everybody, this is Miranda from My Scrappy Life and welcome back to my channel. This is the last day, day number 10 for Christmas Memories with Miranda and Lisa. And before we get started, I am going to tell you I'm sorry, I forgot to hit the start button or the record button on some of this and kind of um, did some of it off camera. So this is going to be a really short video for me, but in the end you will see it. I got the still shots and everything. So. I went and decided to grab mixed media and do some mixed media. Again, I don't mind doing um, reds and stuff on camera because at the end you really don't see it because right now it looks like a big black blob and it'll turn into something at the end. So our theme today is supposed to be take a song and capture it. So I did Baby It's Cold Outside and I took a couple of pictures of one of my Christmas markets where a good friend of mine and... Um, a cup and decided to take a picture by an elf and then I took some still shots of some camera shots of my own cup with the uh, background and those are my pictures and they are in black and white so here I am doing some mixed media I'm just putting down some reds and greens and making it just you know kind of all over because I am going to put all of the title on top of this so you really don't see all of this so right now it just looks kind of blobbish I guess it just looks like a hot mess and so I take these two colors and the two colors that I am using from Shimmers is Vibes the Velveteen Green and the Spritz the Bed of Roses and I'm just placing it all over it now there is a couple of spots that this green and the red kind of mix together and it actually because of the tones and stuff, it kind of turned it a little bit kind of bluish. So that's what, um, so, but it hides. You can't really see it unless you're really looking at it. So here I am, I'm taking my title and I'm putting it um, back on there just to kind of see what it looks like. And there are the pictures. My little elf, my friend Steph, and one of my pictures that I took of my drink um, where the waterfall was at where we took this. Um, as I'm finishing up with uh, the mixed media here, I would like to thank each and every one of you guys that stuck with us for the next for these 10 days. And Lisa and I enjoyed doing this layout. We came up with some good ideas, I felt. And I hope that you can be able to take some of these themes and um, capture it in your guys's scrapbooks, December dailies, Christmas um, memories, and get them put into your layouts as well. Um, so here I go. I decide to... I, I'm not quite sure what I'm trying to do here. I'm waiting to see. Oh, I know what I did. So I took my hand again on the mixed media and are on my, I guess my Versamark and my heat tool. And I act, this actually works out perfect. This leaves um, blobs of little snowflakes within my layout. I made sure that my layout was completely dried before I started to put this down. And I just go ahead and I spritz a bunch of paper on there, or the embossing, which is just white, the embossing paper, excuse me, not paper, powder, yay, I guess I can't talk today. Um, and I just spread it all around and I get it to where it sticks on everything and then um, I come with the heat tool and it's all done. I don't do much of this on camera just because it does um, take me a minute. i got to be able to see where everything's at. And I don't think I left my mixed media a little bit drier than I thought because it left some of it on there. But it takes out. You can see what I did um, and you can see the white little spots on the reds. So now I'm placing down and I decide to hand stitch uh, like a curly... Cr Q, and you'll see it in the still shots um, as well. And I just um, did some curly cues with it and hand stitched. And the hand stitch only took me about, I'd say probably an hour, hour and a half. I sat through and I watched, um, I binge watched a TV show on Netflix. Um, I got into watching um, Young and Hungry. There's five seasons to it. It's only like 20 minute, like a 20 minute show but with the five seasons it I was able to binge watch almost through this whole series as I was trying to make these layouts but I really liked it it was a good show I liked it it was funny 
Um, but uh, I finished watching that while I was doing this. So here I am. I'm just placing everything down. And you'll get to see um, that I'll pull out my tool here in a little bit. And um, I just needed to get it down. And I do, after I finally hand stitch everything, I do actually go back and take my Tombow adhesive and glue down the edges of the letters. I just wanted to make sure that they got stuck down now so that I could be able to do my hand stitching. And I'm placing my pictures down. So here I go. Here it is. At first I was going to do just a straight stitch and then I remembered that I had this curly this loopy loop one. So I did this loopy loop through and some of it's straight, some of it's crooked or kind of at a diagonal. I didn't really much care. I just wanted it there for texture and I wanted it to look kind of like just an added feel to it because I wasn't going to embellish much because literally my title and my mixed media is my embellishment on this one. So it worked out um, perfect for that. So here I go. You'll see a little bit of this. I think I have you see a lot of this because I thought that um, I placed a lot more in there and I thought I after this one you will see <laughs> that I go really slow in real time because I think I'm gonna um, show you a little bit more of it um, so in like real time you know at the end because I like I said I made the boo-boo I thought I hit play and I didn't so this is a really, really short one. Um, before we get to the point of me telling you what I did, um, if you like this series, give us a, a thumbs up on all of our videos. Um, hit that subscribe button as well if you want to see some more because I have tons of new series that are coming up in the new year. And I will have some other layouts at the end of this year too um, that we've come up with. It's pretty cool. Um, so be on the lookout for those and just my normal process video. I'm kind of um, christmas eve out for layout, so you'll see some normal stuff. So here I am. I thought I hit the play button, but I didn't. So I took out my other layouts, and I wanted to show you guys a little bit of what happened. So I put down my journaling, and then I took the embellishments, and I placed them all around. So there's little stars, so there's some stars, some snowflakes, and then I put the sticker Wonders of Winter, and I also, once we get moving down here a little bit, I must be pointing and not realizing I'm off camera, and then I cut this long strip, and it says like hats and boots and mittens and gloves and all that kind of stuff, and then I add some mittens there, and then at the end, down below, you'll see... Um, my journaling and I added my journal in there and then I did do my date stamp so thank you for checking in with our series staying with us and I hope you have a scrappy holiday week um, week coming up and I will talk to you soon bye